R.L. Dabney once predicted that Christians must prepare themselves for the following results. All Bibles, prayers, and catechisms will ultimately be driven out of the schools. And we look at that today and say, there were catechisms in the schools. If you simply, thoughtlessly send your kids to the secular progressives for an education, they will return your children to you as strangers. One day, Nancy said to me, Doug, I can't see handing Becca over to someone we don't know, saying, here she is, educator. And I didn't know anything about Christian education, except that I agreed with that. Christians need to become accustomed to that great two-word prayer, which is Geronimo, amen. <laughs> when we started Logos School, I'll say at the outset, it helps to be crazy. You saw between the mid-90s and the mid-2000s, schools pop up all over the country. So my options were either to homeschool or to move to another city that has such a school, which was not an option at the time, or to start a school. And so I don't know exactly how that happened, but I ended up starting my own school now 11 years ago. And I tell people getting involved in classical Christian education, I warn parents when I interview them, you know, it's dangerous. We started with brave 20 students. Their parents were our trailblazing parents. Yeah, there was a couple times that, that uh, Tall Oaks was threatened with closing its doors, but uh, God kept his hand on us and uh, a lot of people jumped in and wouldn't let that happen. When you line up all the events of how the school came together, it doesn't really add up and make logical sense that we pulled this off. I think the greatest evidence for God's hand in classical Christian education are the schools that exist right now. I wanted my children to have the kind of education that I didn't have. Classical Christian education goes with the way God designed humans. Do you want to give your kids the tools of learning that are sharp? Raising kids is a timed event with eternal consequences. So, so God says, okay, on your marks, get set, go. Okay.